Hey y'all, well, welcome back to my home and kitchen. Tonight, um, I am going to be making a pumpkin pie. It is that time of year. Um, Thursday is uh, Thanksgiving, so uh, I've got a lot of cooking to do. So tonight, I am making a pumpkin pie. Last night, I made a pecan pie. And I actually was going to make a video and show you guys, but my camera was up at the building where we had that big community gathering. And I couldn't make uh, one with my phone. It was acting really crazy. I could never get it to work like it was supposed to. So I finally said just heck with it. But anyway, this is what we're doing tonight and I just wanted you guys to come along with okay. me. I've got my oven preheating to 375 and we're just gonna throw this together um, one thing I am doing a little bit different this year is I'm going to be using the pumpkin pie spice instead of the different spices uh, so I'm gonna kind of test it as a, after I go I know it's gonna have some raw eggs in it it's never killed me before please don't put anybody any bad comments down below it is what it is, okay? So here we go. I have got probably about, it's not two cups, but it's probably about a cup and three fourths of pumpkin. And after that, I'm going to put the sweet and condensed milk. It's about a cup and three fourths. Two eggs beaten lightly. I've got two thirds cup of brown sugar. I have got two tablespoons of regular sugar. I've got, I'm going to do, well, let's go ahead and do this, about a half a teaspoon of salt, and I'm going to do a teaspoon right now of the pumpkin pie uh, seasoning. Let me do it like this, so I don't want to get way too much, because I've never used this before, and I'm not quite sure how much to use, so. We're gonna put about a teaspoon of that in there. And we're gonna beat this for two minutes. Okay. I did not make my pie crust. I've just got a pre-made one. And let's see, here's Mia. I'm gonna take a fork and I'm just going to poke holes in it. It is supposed to help for, uh, for the bubbling so it won't bubble up. The pie crust won't bubble up. Now, I will be very honest, I am not a baker at all, a lot of this. Um, I mean, I've made pies before, don't get me wrong, but I just don't bake. I like to cook, but I, 
I just never was one to really get into the bacon aspect of everything. The cakes and the pies and the cookies and the all that. It just wasn't my thing. Which is crazy because I love sweets, you know. Okay. And then we're going to pour this into my dish. And there we go. My oven has just dinged, so I'm going to stick this in there. And we're going to bake it for... I believe it's 45 minutes, and if it looks like uh, it needs to bake a little bit more, I'll bake it for maybe another 5 to 10 minutes. We'll just have to wait and see. And also, um, if my crust begins to get a little bit too brown, I'm going to bring it out, and I'm going to put tinfoil around the edges of my pie. And uh, I'll show you that if that absolutely happens. But I hope it don't. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to put this in the oven for 45 minutes, and then we'll go from there. Okay, guys, that's it. There it is. Thank y'all for watching tonight. Please hit that like button and subscribe, and I will catch y'all on the next video.